morning, sunshines. Welcome to another Nikki vlog. I'm in my hometown, in my parents' house. Good times, you know, good times had by all. Today, I am borrowing my mom's car to go drive up to Houston just to like have lunch with Sammy, hang out with her for a little bit, and then I'm gonna come right back because my sister has a volleyball game, so that's a lot of driving in my future. So I'm gonna download like a podcast or something and head out here in a moment and we're gonna see Sammy again. But yesterday was fun. I've just been hanging out with my sisters a lot. I took them all homecoming dress shopping yesterday. Got everyone cute little dresses and I'm pumped. Tomorrow, or today's Cheyenne's football game, or sorry, I can talk, I have a brain. Today is Cheyenne's volleyball game. It's against their rivals and it's not in their home gym or whatever. So I'm going to that to root for her. She's very nervous, but excited. I know she's gonna win, it'll be fine. And then homecoming dance, which has been a little bit of drama about <laughs> because I Instagrammed that I was gonna go as a chaperone because my parents are going as chaperones and then all three of my sisters are going. And this is the only year that they can do that because Shelby's a senior, Cheyenne's a sophomore and Savannah's in eighth grade, but she got invited by a ninth grader like a boy a year older, so she can go to this dance too. So this is the only year in all of existence that all three of my sisters will be there and both my parents are going. So they were like, oh, Nikki, you can go as a chaperone too if you just wanna go and just be a part of it. It's a really small like private school, whatever. And then I guess one of the moms heard about it and said that it wouldn't be right if I went because I'd be a distraction and like ruin the dance for the girls or something, which I thought was weird because it's not like I'm gonna go in a club dress, you know, I'm like, but that was a little bit of a tiff. Parents were upset, my sisters were upset. But then we asked for permission and I guess it's okay if I come because I came all the way from California. I literally haven't been to my parents' house since like Christmas. I don't even remember the last time I was here. Literally probably since Christmas. So I don't see them very often, needless to say. I mean, my I've seen my dad and my mom since then, but not here. So they allowed me to go because it's a private gym and technically their dance is not a school function. So I have to, ask for permission. It's not like a school dance for you to show up or something. Obviously, because why would this 27 year old chick just show up to a high school dance randomly and be allowed to go? Regardless, I'm just trying to send this footage to Ashley. My computer will hurry up so she can get the bachelorette video up. And then I am off to Houston for a long day of driving, but getting to see my best friend. I need to stop doing that. I know this is weird and stupid. Okay, let's go. I've been in a car for so long. I went to Houston, had a great lunch with Sammy. It was so good. I miss her a lot. I didn't record because I obviously I was just so caught up in chatting and everything. But I'm almost to the volleyball game. It's gonna be great. There goes my phone and my GPS. Morning, sunshine. It's my last day with my family. It's a good husband right there. Good dad, good husband. This is Savannah. Look at your eyes, you look so pretty, and my face looks really red next to your perfect baby skin. <laughs> I've been teaching them skincare this week so they can keep their perfect baby skin forever. Mm. Excuse me? Hello. I would like some enthusiasm, <laughs> ma'am. <laughs> The alarm is off again! We're trying to make cinnamon rolls. It's clearly struggling. Doop -a -doop -a -doop. Look a little better. I think that maybe that's good, or maybe like one more minute. I don't know. I don't know. What do you think? I don't know. They're just not brown yeah. yet, but they're not, I don't want them to be black. So. One more minute! This is a fridge yes. about my parents. Yes. And you can do fun stuff. Like write messages. That's cool. What the heck is that? Oh, it's October 1st. What the heck are they doing? Here's our cinnamon rolls of the morning. Dad also made us tacos this morning, and I made him try vegan cheese, and he said it was tasty, and he couldn't tell the difference. Also, the first ingredient is filtered water, which I find weird. This is just water, high-calorie water. 
Why are your eyes so pretty? I have, I have the color pop on on my camera and it's making your eyes like blue. And then your eyes are more green. Her eyes are blue and green. It just depends her mood, girl. Yeah. Mood rings. You know, what am I saying? I just put them in my eyes. My eyes are brown. Fun fact, both my parents have brown eyes. And look what came out. This girl. And that girl. I found Savannah in her natural habitat. <laughs> Sitting on a counter, eating cinnamon rolls. <laughs> yes, Belle. What can I do for you? <laughs> Look at my cute little mama. You're so cute. You're so silly. She's so little like me. Saying bye to the family. Well, you're going to the airport with me. Yeah. <laughs> Got home the apartment and my boyfriend cleaned everything so nice and lit all these candles and I got flowers and wine and a Reese's and everything's so clean but I don't know where he is. Rude. Good morning sunshines and welcome back to Los Angeles, California with the love of my life. Mm. My mom's cats let me do whatever I want to them. Like you can throw them over your shoulder, you can pick them up, you can do anything. They don't care. Max, a little more particular. Oh yes, my love. You went and look out the window. You love the window. Got home. Got a bunch of packages. Gym shirt stuff is in. Got all sorts of stuff. We just went to Target and had a restock of a bunch of crap. And yeah, I'm back home and I'm so excited and there's so much to do and so much to think about and so much to fulfill and just my whole life just started all over again and I don't feel afraid to leave the house anymore. I'm not afraid, but I don't know, you know, how I was feeling kind of hermit-ish. I don't feel like that now. I feel like I can go do things and conquer the world. So let's do it. One package we got, I have no idea what this is. It says Caffeine Hit from Nails Inc. Saw this. Ooh, like this cup. The first coffee. Very nice. Oh, it's nail stuff, which is nice because my nails are not done right now. Nail stuff. French roast coffee. Perfect. I'll put it in my espresso machine. And some cute little nail colors. Oh, that's a nice fall color. Oh, I love this color. I'm going to paint my nails with it right now. And an exfoliating coffee scrub. It's pretty dope. I'll let you know how it goes. Also, I would like to point out that my skin did completely clear out while I was gone. I don't know why. I was sleeping in my makeup half the time, barely washing my face. Well, I would wash my face every day, but only in the mornings at night I kept forgetting. <laughs> and this is what happened. So I think LA is the actual cause for my breakouts. Thank you, Los Angeles. Max has proceeded to get inside every box that I have opened so far. Speaking of LA weather attributing to my breakouts, I got two humidifiers for the apartment to see if maybe the dry climate, I can combat that a little bit. I don't even know, this is just a theory that I read online, so I did it. So I got two of these off Amazon. They're just highly rated, they're not too expensive, and they're pretty big. Shout out to my boyfriend and his yellow pants. So apparently it just emits a little steam. It's kinda cool. I put it on medium right now, light, medium, high. Oh shit, no, go back, sorry. <laughs> We'll see. I don't know if that's gonna do anything at all, but you know, I hope. Also, when I got home, I had a new weigh-in. Remarkably, a Christmas miracle. A Cabo miracle. I put the second one right here in my bedroom next to my bed. Purify my skin. Good morning, sunshines. Welcome to another day in paradise. I'm starting off this morning. We went to the gym and my pre-workout cookie. <laughs> It's just this bite meals, snickerdoodle cookies, which I'm obsessed with. Here you go. They're vegan. They're delicious. I love them. And here we go.
full body circuit because this is my first workout since I've been back home and I kind of just want to hit a tiny little bit of everything so I was kind of making up stuff as I went to be honest this was not a professional well workout that I've really done before I just tried to mix up some things so I could do leg movement and upper body movement and the same kind of whatever it was a cool workout I had fun doing it and it kicked my butt I'm really tired I have burned 520 calories according to my polar watch and now I'm gonna go back and Jazzy and I are gonna run around Hollywood. It's gonna be great. And we're going to Universal Studios tonight. I'm so excited. Halloween Horror Nights. Dun 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 dun. I'm also feeling really good about my body right now. Look at my new hips. I have hip dips. I don't care. And I feel really lean. My butt feels popping. And I lost some weight on my vacation. I mean, I look better from some angles than others, you know. <laughs> but overall, pretty good progress from not working out. This is my favorite pose. Or Grace's pose where she puts her foot like all the way over here. And then she lays. But her waist is so tiny. Anyway. <laughs> so my physique feels good. I'm excited for Paris in like eight days, nine days, very soon. <laughs> 